our scenario we're going to be a guitar shop so we're imagining our employees have guitar lessons that they provide we're not doing this in order to process the payroll at this point we're entering the time into a timesheet for the billable time on which we can then charge the clients that they have been working for so let's go all the way to the right we need some kind of worksheet which in practice if you're using accounting software you might have built into the accounting software the option for the time to be entered directly into the accounting software something like a quickbooks could have that feature available to you which can make it easier in some ways because then you can link the timesheet to the invoice that you will be creating however you don't have to do that many types of firms might have outside software that's going to help to track the in, the billable time that you might then have your your customers or your employees be using or you might uh, you might just have them use a spreadsheet and say hey this is what i want you to put your information on a week by week basis give me your billable time your non-billable time track that information use it then to create your invoices at the end of the week or bi-weekly or monthly or something like that so in that case we're, we're going to kind of mirror that here so last time we, we 